from the University of California at Davis. This is News Watch. This steelhead is undergoing a surgical procedure at UC Davis. Fish biologists are inserting a detector under the skin so they can track its movement. Researchers are attempting to find out how steelhead and Chinook salmon react to environmental changes along the Sacramento River. This detector sends a signal that is picked up by scores of listening devices that have been placed in the river and San Francisco Bay. Scientists hope to have 400 fish equipped with these sensors by winter. We can find out what depth they're moving at and those physical parameters that go along with it. After the fish has recovered from surgery, it is then taken to the Sacramento River near Antioch, where its migration route is studied. These researchers tracked this one fish nonstop for five days. Marine biologist Pete Klimley says migratory fish are threatened by dredging, agriculture, and even non-native species. What we really need to know is norm normalcy. If we can ever know normalcy in this kind of Frankenstonian river of ours that we've changed so much through the gold rush and farming and so forth. But we need to uh, look at the river, look at different types of habitat and see if the fish pass through it quickly, if they are not eaten by predators. This new three-year study will help state agencies manage river systems more efficiently. Okay. Reporting along the Sacramento River, I'm Paul Fodenauer. For more information, please log on to broadcast.ucdavis.edu.